lived in the city all my life. So uh, we're actually at a forest reservation. Um, so it's really different. Uh, we went on a two hour hike, which was really different from what I'm used to. Here is the top of the holy forest. And that tree is Chima Walishii that the villagers select to be a holy tree. They believe that this tree can protect their village. Every year on the Mong, Mong New Year actually, they have some celebration here. Oh wow, up here. Oh. Up here. Coming here to Chiang Mai, um, I didn't know that a lot of the um, Hmong people that live here, they have to change their name to Thai, so you kind of don't know who is Hmong or who is Thai. So coming to a village that's like just all Hmong, um, was really, I feel like rewarding because one of the reasons why I came here was because I kind of wanted to trace back my roots. This made it feel don't satisfy. My parents immigrated from um, Thailand to America after the Vietnam War. So definitely seeing how they are living or like being able to talk to someone that knows my language, it definitely is something that um, I'm glad that I'm able to experience. And this is our classroom.